Hi all you lovely people so today I'll be showing you how I did this very nice very easy Turkish Kashmiri inspired makeup tutorial which is inspired mainly by Halima Sultan from Ertugil Ghazi series oh guys I love this series and I am really going to marry Ertugil I'm telling you all so okay let's start with it so after I applied my MAC prep and prime I'm just going to go ahead and apply my corrector from K and uh, it's working really well I'm using this corrector for the first time it's really nice next thing I'm going to go ahead and apply my foundation and blend it in very nicely on my skin I'll also be using my concealer and conceal all my beautiful flaws like always. और पहले की सारी मेहनत को सेट करने के लिए अब हम यूज़ करेंगे कॉम्पैक्ट Next I'll be using this very natural looking very earthy shade from Nykaa and I'll be applying this in two tones on my eyelids. Guys make sure you don't overdo your eyes in this specific makeup because we have to keep it very natural and uh, very smooth. We'll be applying eyeliner only on the outer corners of my eyes and making sure that it is not very dark. It is just giving a hint of the eyeliner or the eye pencil. Make sure you really do your eyebrows very well in this specific makeup because eyebrows are very important in this tutorial because we are not emphasizing on the eye makeup or the lip makeup. We are emphasizing on a very natural looking makeup. So make sure that your eyebrows are one thing that are very nice and standing out in this. Make sure they are fuller and looking very uh, nice and healthy also generously apply your mascara but don't overdo it because you know we just want to make sure that our eyelashes are looking nice and big and extended but we don't want to overdo it next thing I'm just going to go ahead and curl my lashes I'm just highlighting my brow bone with some highlighter this is a very important step you all I'm applying Dear Darling Lip and Cheek Tint on my cheeks to give it a very natural flush on my cheeks. And if you think that you have applied a lot, then you can always blend it with your blender. For me, there is no enough cheek color anytime. Next, I'm applying my favorite MAC Ruby Woo and I'm just going to go ahead and dab it on my lips. I'm not going to apply it straight up. So you know it gives a very natural tint on my lips and it doesn't look overdone. Ta-da! The makeup is complete but to complete the look I'm going to go ahead and wear a very nice headgear to give it a nice Turkish or a Kashmiri look and voila it looks amazing. I'm really happy with how this getup is turning out and let me show you guys the complete look. I really really love this makeup look I mean it is so simple you all I mean even beginners could do it and it gives your skin a very nice very glowing look also highlights your best features so what else do you want if you like this please go ahead and like comment and subscribe thank you for watching